Hey you guys, what's going on? I'm just here to show you a quick video or make you a quick video on how to get your OBS stream overlay sexiness on top of your PlayStation 4 gameplay for streaming or making your videos or whatever you want to do with it. Um, anyway, so first off what you're going to need is you're going to be needing the PS4 Remote Play desktop app uh, from the website which I'll be putting up here and down in the description. Um, so what you have to do is you have to go and go ahead and download that first of all, get that installed and uh, next you'll be needing to make a secondary PlayStation account. I'll get to why in a minute. So uh, what you need to do is you need to install all that. Whoa! Haha! <laughs> that will come later. Um, install all that and you'll be greeted with this little screen up here on the top left. Uh, so what you need to do there is you need to head over to the settings button in the bottom left of that, uh, which will bring up the window to the right of your screen now uh, with the PlayStation Network sign-in. So after you've made your second account on your PlayStation, uh, you need to sign in to that second account on this uh, PS4 Remote Play app. Uh, it's probably going to ask for a device pairing uh, code, so you're going to need your um, your pairing key. Uh, to get that, you have to head over to your console on the second account, I think. Yes, it is. It's the, you need to be on the second account on your console. Uh, then you head over to settings, remote play connection settings, and then from there you go add device. Uh, when you go add device, you'll be getting a key to connect, and that's all good and set up to go once you punch it into the Remote Play app on the desktop side of things. So once you're connected to that, um, don't worry about signing in yet. Uh, you'll need to set your resolutions and your frame rates and all that. Uh, I can't tell you what the perfect combination is. That's for you to decide depending on network and uh, PC power and whatnot. What it's really dependent on your network. Uh, I've brought up the best here just to show you this extra box that pops up down the bottom left when you click that. Uh, it says, the best 1080p is available for CUH 7000 series PS4s only. For other PS4s, the resolution will be high 720p. So, what I think the CUH 7000 series is, it may actually be the iteration um, of the original PS4, I think the re reiteration of that console. I think it's the one with the clicky power button and the clicky eject uh, instead of the touch sensitive buttons that everybody loves to hate. Um, don't trust me on that. It could be the slim model or it could be the Pro. I'm not sure. Anyway, it's not much of a big deal. Uh, for this test, I'm actually, or for this video, I've actually got it set to low. Um, just for smoothness sake. Um, anyway, yeah, so once you're done with that, uh, connect it all up and you will be ready to rock. Uh, I've got my share play set up. So what this allows you to do is it allows you to play on your main account on your TV without having any input lag while streaming. So if you were to use your main account via remote play on your PC you'll be experiencing network lag and input lag and you'll be a couple of seconds behind everybody else which is absolutely terrible for first person shooters and anything really. So uh, pretty much what this is is the secondary account is a screen watcher it's capturing everything that, com that comes from the console without actually having any direct input. So you'll still be playing your game on your TV like normal uh, I've actually turned down the sound, so it does have sound. Uh, the sound does come through the computer. Bam! There it is. So yeah, that's a quick and nasty, simple way on how to get your overlays up on top of your PlayStation stuff. Um, for the overlays and everything else, you have to check out another OBS video or such. Um, on YouTube. There's plenty of them out there. I'm not actually going to go into much detail on it because that's a different story. Uh, it's going to take you a while to figure out and set up for yourself to have everything how you want it. I'm 
just showing off. Uh, this is pretty sexy now. Uh, anyway, I've actually got an Xbox One. I don't have an account associated with this channel, so sorry about that. It's not there. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, if you have any questions, um, feel free to drop a comment down in the comments box. And uh, I'll catch you later.